welcome. This is Mahi Bengaluru podcast and today you are listening to an audio story on how to take care of your mental health. An article by Ms. Lakshmi Kashyap, student counselor, Mahi Bengaluru. Student life marks as one of the greatest milestones in a person's life. This is the age where you find yourself transitioning into a fully grown adult. You're learning how to be on your own, figure out who you are and find your purpose. These are the experiences that come with great challenges. To tackle these challenges effectively, you need to be healthy, both physically and mentally. Good mental health is essential for overall well-being and it acts as a contributor to students' ability to find success. It helps students develop and maintain a healthy relationship both with themselves and others. How can students protect and nourish their mental health? Here are some tips. Stress management and self-care. Stress is one of the leading casual factors in deteriorating mental health. Whenever possible, try and reduce or manage the stress that you are experiencing. One effective way to do that is to give yourself a break and more importantly, acknowledge that it is okay to take a break. Do not overburden yourself. Learn your patterns and behaviors. When you see yourself burning out, balance it out by doing something that works against your stress. Reward yourself when the job is done. Validate your actions and acknowledge your hard work. Take care of your physical health. Physical health is an important factor in maintaining good mental health. Get 7 to 8 hours of sleep every night. Imbalance in your sleep cycle can have a negative effect on your well-being. Have nutritious food. Make note of your nutrient intake from the point of view of nurturing your body. Lack of food and nutrition can have a negative effect on your body and mind. Be physically active whenever possible. Go for a morning run and walk whenever or wherever possible. And lastly, reach out. It is always a good idea to talk it out. If and when you do find yourself in a slump, seek help. Do not be under the impression that you can do everything on your own. Reach out to the campus counselor or therapist. Talk it out with the people you trust. Do not bottle up your feelings and thoughts as they can have hazardous effects on your mental health. Sit with your feelings and feel comfortable in being vulnerable with yourself. Try out these tips and don't forget to have a lot of fun.